Howdy caddies, weekly walkabout time with the collector, hope you're going good, we've been bloody busy this week, we've got heaps of cool stuff in the sale, it's all nice gold jewellery in the jewellery cabinet, a little cross pendant set with diamonds, this is a nice sovereign mounted, tumbled amber necklace, jaguar bonnet mascot, fantastic little Japanese pistol shaped cigarette lighter, you got advertising bottle openers and things, Italian art glass bird, silver, pocket knives, cigarette lighters, nice little power shell trinket box with heaps of power shell jewellery in it, some more nice little pocket knives, cigarette lighter, permanent match, nice couple of other little art glass aminals, two more nice bits of glass, the vase at the left, so I think Bertil Valian, Costa Boda, Menseco watch, there's a nice men's long jeans watch, advertising pen knives, pocket knives, some nice Art Deco half dolls. Good stuff in the jewellery cabinet. Little aeroplanes are cool too. Japanese table, little hole table, big two-piece sort of bird bath. A lovely little ebonized Japanese table with the mother of pearl inlay. Uh, glazed bookcase, nice 1980s display cabinet, teak veneer. He's pretty cool, the Japanese kimono stand. Got a nice little sort of retro style three-fold screen. Little Japanese tables, cute. Big purple pot. This is pretty cool. Little quack medicine electric sort of therapy set. With all the bits to go in, made it by in England by iHeal. Really cool thing. It all works. He's a ripper. Sewing machines, a whatnot. Nice collection of cut crystal and glass. Some cars. What else have we got? Some sort of graduating gowns. Clothing and material. Pretty china and stuff. This is all sort of bed linen, brand new. Single bed, double bed, queen bed, sheet sets. More material, some cool sort of eastern stuff. Tools and blokey gear. Some little boxed. Cars in the little sort of Perspex displays, including the cool Jag E-Type. These are all car badges, records, some nice stuff in here. It's hard to see. They box weighs a ton, some big heavy irons, sad irons and other stuff. Collection of Australian and other pottery and gear, little lamps, pretty cool. All right, what else? Materials. Big group lot, four boxes, a mix of the household stuff. Yeah, so we've got heaps of wooden carved sort of coat racks and book stands. Nice little sort of stool up the end, which you can't see. <laughs> yeah. There will be better pictures of a lot of this stuff on the website, guys. you got boxes of sort of glass, crystal, and EP&S. And this, you've got, this is cool, little sort of mid-century white little desk. Unusual size. It's nice with those cool little sort of leg down the left-hand side there. What else have we got? Box of interesting books, depending on what you're interested in. It's mainly Australian historical, New Guinea, stuff like that. Some nice costume jewellery in big lots. Some really nice swap cards there. A couple of cool sort of bull's head can openers. More pocket knives. A little lot of tins and boxes. Some padlocks. Big box of carpenter's planes. What else have we got? Fishing gear, the two big planters are a separate lot. You've got all those fishing rods in them and all the sort of tackle boxes and stuff there. There's a nice big group. Cool little 80 stereo system. A cool old uh, Cyclops pram. What else have we got? Records, pictures. I think it's a diamond back freestyle BMX. Heaps of tools, sash clamps. Sewing machines and a little sort of electric heater. Big lot, three boxes of all the die-cast toy trucks and stuff. This is a collection of all sort of novelty animal figures. The shell ones are pretty cool over the back. And this is all sort of English china, some interesting bits, nice stuff in amongst. I, like I think it's Arthur Wood cabinet plate over the back. Uh, Eastern materials, two boxes full. We've got the two nice big low Japanese coffee tables. All the caneware and sort of baskets and stuff. Little dolls pram with some dolls and stuff in it. Pictures, prints, 
cool games. The horse racing game works. Wacky races. Slot car set's got the cars. Two more nice little planters. Die casts. Three boxes at a mixed household. Big lot of tools. Nice color box of kids' books and stuff. All the dolls and cane were up on top of the table. It's a nice little Japanese sort of little kitchen cabinet. Sliding doors. Three drawers in the middle, two at the blower. I like this little sort of low, little two-fold screen. Really nicely made. And he's nice as well. Little, another little Japanese cabinet. Little sort of window in the back's pretty cool. A lovely sort of patina and stuff on these. And this is nice, the big sort of mid-century modern screen. A little bit of damage up the top as you can see there, but a bit of a black texture will fix that up, or a bit of nugget boot polish. Really nice, all the, all the sort of pierced panels are in great nick. Big collection of pots and plants. Nice little teak box with a lift-up lid. We've got some cool set of 670s art dining chairs. Big retro day bed. Big pot. I can almost fit in that bloody thing. Make a good bathtub. Two more planters over the back. Big sort of tall boy chest of drawers. Lovely little expandable book bookshelf there with the carved bears. Probably Black Forest or something. Nice retro lamp. Looks to be Ellis. No marks. This is pretty cool. A little T-bar sort of clothes rack with a lovely big ornate heavy base. So we've got some really nice paintings this week. I haven't shown you down here either, I don't think. We've got more sort of peach glass and English china. Cars, lacquerware. Cars, this is a whole bloody big shelf lot of glass and crystal. Collection of glass, some of the bits are damaged. The carnival's got a bit of damage. Three supercars. Three sort of American muscle cars. More sort of races, a couple of cool Jags, E-Type and an XJS. That's all Australian pottery down the bottom with a ring in or two. Some nice paintings, John Stanesco, Northern Territory. Big Neil Savage, Cityscape, 1979. This is a nice Lawrence Kermond. This is a Meg Jerez, lovely little oil. I think there's another nice big Lawrence Kermond here as well. Great sort of traditional painter. I think he studied under good old Ernie Buckmaster. And he can paint. Nice thing. Max Miller, little aqua tint. Sort of the back Tim Bass abstract. Great little thing, 1973. John Mutt Sayers, little frame diptych. Hey, who? Oh, uh, Lawrence J. Whiteley. It's a really nice thing. No relation to Brett. And else have we got? Frank Mutsayers. And this is nice. I think it's Jane Henderson. Lovely big oil painting of Wandong. Really nice thing. All right, good paintings. Construction sort of toys. Got a cool bright red telephone, a couple of nice little sort of 1900 oil paintings. One of the little lighthouse there is kind of cool. Electric jugs, some die casts, cool lot of tankards, the Renault sign, some nice vintage dolls, big lot of sort of petrol tankers, someone's bloody coffee cup, it's full. Put a lot number on that. There's a cool little lot, the flexi straws in their original box. Two cool little books, Pears edition of Charles Dickens, three nice supercars, some box German Solitos, nice collection of wooden items, a couple of little English sports cars, a Lotus and an MG, nice collection of Royal Albert, some cool retro sort of yellow coloured stuff, the Salter scales are nice with their original measuring bowls, cool thermos, a lot of metalware, more lacquerware. Sort of Japanese items, ceramics and bowl stands and plate stands. A couple of Mustangs. Chrysler Radio. It's a nice book on aircraft. World War II. Aircraft of the Fighting Powers. It's got all sort of pull-out plates and specifications. American uh, die-cast Solitos. It's a nice big sort of tribal bowl. 
A little sort of deck tile underneath. Some racing cars. Some more American ones. Dome clocks. Tennis rackets. Crutches. Bed warmer. Nice pair. It takes sort of deers or stags from the 70s. It's a nice big cast iron doorstop of a Scottish bloke. A nice sort of bit of heavy cast iron sort of trellis work there. Footy stuff. More lacquerware. Little collection. Nice little Clossone vase with a sort of scale-like decoration. This is all signed art glass. Caithness over the back. These two bits are both signed. Ladies' bags and jewellery. English china. Beswick and Beatrix Potter and stuff. Nice lot of Chinese stuff. Japanese stuff. A couple of cool races, the Bugatti and the Merc, a big bug. A sort of Art Deco ceramics, the Wedgwood tea set and a nice figure. Three more races, he's pretty cool. The American US Mail letterbox with the Cardinals. Art glass animals. Three races. Three more little French die casts. Box of Japanese items. And this we've got a big lot of die cast trucks and stuff down the bottom. Nice pair of the twin arm uh, little piano sconces. Some nice glass. Car badges. A couple of cool tins. Nice little group lot of mixed items. The can opener is pretty cool. There you go. The new and the old. The Aston Martins. Motorbikes. I think it's an Aston Martin and a Lancia. Little money bank's cool. Wedgwood. Two more bits. Two Mustangs. All the box trucks. So we've got some really nice swap cards in those three albums. Collection of amber coloured glass. Nice little lot of Japanese. More nice art glass over the back. The pickup truck Jim Beam decanter. Big lot of boxed Wedgwood. A couple of American racers. The Corvette and the AC Cobra. Bottle of Pims. Three nice bits. The Moorcroft speckled and the nice sort of German coffee pot over the back. Now so we got Atomizer. Oz Pottery, Edwin Shaw, I think, is a little ramekin. Two bits of Maroud, which other people call Remued. Uh, a little Triumph and another MG. Japanese figures, this little donkey with the bobble head. He's great, and he's turning around trying to get the little ladybird off his bum. Little deer's nice with a bit of a cubist look about it, and then you can't go past a big frog. Oz Pottery, Celadon Glaze, we've put with a nice little bit of Kubasek Schiller enamelware. Art glass over the back. The jug, even though it looks clear up the top, it's all orange and red down the bottom to match the glasses. Two more cool little English races, a Lotus and a little Austin Healy. I think it's, oh, it's a Clubman or something like that, can't remember. Uh, aluminium canister set's nice. He's a nice little clock. What else we got the sort of water cooler bag. Nice big brass knocker. Oh, I think it's a modern body with a nice jume head or something like that on it. Can't remember. Sheet music framed up's nice. It's a collection of comic books in that folder. This is interesting. The big copper sort of pot. Bottle of Corio Special Whiskey. Really nice wall mask, sort of 1950s. It's a nice bit of lacquerware, Japanese. that's sort of signed to the base. Uh, brass nude. Bag. Milne's bottle of whiskey. Big art glass vase, a couple of nice tins, some Valiant chargers, lacquerware, the Mount Fuji tray over the back's really quite nice. These are nice little sort of teak modernist figures. This little ram is fantastic. There's no signatures on them. Uh, cool bit of Italian as well, the horse, Alan Lowe teapot, Monaro. I've got some Ford Falcons over the back in their little displays. What else have we got? Kind of like these, a little Allen Lowe miniature set there with a little cruet set as well. What else have we got? Beswick and Balik. The Burmese satin glass over the back's lovely. A little yellow uh, bug-eyed Sprite's a ripper. Corio Special Whiskey again. We've got some nice stuff up the top. We've got the big GTS Monaro. Nice bit of Italian glass. And the Italian owl vase, big Claris Cliff reference book. Another nice bit of glass. The robot, he's a ripper, he's going to be the what's it worth, he works. 
This is a nice little Beryl Armstrong miniature sort of pottery cruet set. Another nice bit of glass from the 80s. Another nice bit of glass, satin. And the big sort of Chinese vase, which is marked at the base. There's some more stuff I could probably show you guys. Tea towels and jewellery and shells and eggs. More Ford pickup trucks and stuff. Looks like an old XP or an XMU. There you go. That'll do, guys. Hopefully you saw something you liked. Hopefully we see you on Thursday night. Be a good auction.